And now, coming to you from the back lot of Warner Brothers Studios, your host, from the new WB series Charm, Shannon Doherty. And from Dawson's Creek, Joshua Jackson. Welcome to 17, The Faces for Fall. Hi, this is the Stars Movie Theater of Choice. Josh, the show's silly. Yeah, yeah. You know, this guy, he gets a lot of press. But not him. And who does he think he is? I mean, does he have a show on the WB? Is he co-starring with James Vanderbeek? No, I don't think so. But he is our new face of the fall. So let's take a look. Matt, you're too modest. I guarantee we'd watch four, five days. We'll have to see each other in the shower once or twice. I'm such a one-track mind. Let's get back to movies, shall we? Want to know what the stars of I Know What You Did Last Summer did this past summer? Take a shower with Matt Damon? It's disgusting. They actually, no. They were up to much more murder and mayhem, and I still know. You know, something really big hit me while I was reading this. All the stars are connected to Kevin Bacon. As in six degrees of Kevin Bacon? No, as in 17 degrees of Kevin Bacon. The kind of town where everyone right now would be rushing to mob Josh. Better known as Casey on Dawson Street. What kind of name is Casey, anyway? Uh, French for a handsome, sensitive, sarcastic man in the world. Ah, uh, aha. Well, for some real answers on why Dawson Creek is to the nerves, we went on location with the task team. So, Josh, what's it like being a sex symbol? No, I have absolutely no idea. Thank God. For stuff like that, you're, you're probably better off talking to Denise Richards. She's one of those wild things. You know, this is the gazebo where they filmed that great old song and dance movie, The Music Man. Oh, you like musicals? Well, then you must have seen Drew Barrymore in her musical, Everyone Says I Love You. Actually, let's skip the trivia and get right to the real thing. So, for stars or anyone, looking back on your younger days is never easy. Yeah, but it makes a great television. In fact, we tracked down Elijah Wood at the diner called Swinger, and forced him to tell the tale of his career. Forced him? Oh, well, we brought him on. Guys like Elijah have some perspective in the show business, but when you're lucky, it can really drive you nuts. Absolutely. Take Carrie Russell, for example. She's the star of the new WB show, Felicity. In Maverick, Mel Gibson hung out in his very saloon. Just the latest in a long line of manly men who could these in two streets. Well, the frontier is not just for guys, you know. I mean, Jewel just finished her first movie. It's a western set back in the Civil War. Sounds pretty much of yeah, it. It is. But don't worry. We've got Jewel doing what she does best. We're communing with nature. We're saying, take a look. Save your soul, Judge. I've actually been considering that. And the answer is Natasha Leon. You may not know a whole lot about her right now, but she's going to be huge. This place is a perfect stand-in for New York City. Now, in the spirit of equal time, how about a little guy watching? Oh, sure. Watch away. That's what I'm here for. Actually, Josh, I was thinking about Oscar de la Hoya. Oh, I knew that. I did. Yeah, Oscar, we're pals, you know. <laughs> Far with him a little bit. Oscar may be able to take Chavez, but neither one of them will last a single round with Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Agreed. But even vampire players need some time off. So to find out how they unwound, we followed Sarah Michelle Gellar on her summer getaway. You know, Sarah Michelle Gellar's been on the cover of Seventeen magazine, and I mentioned that Carrie Russell did a photo shoot, and now it's time for the new It Boy. Joshua Jackson, Cliff Ma, top of the world. You made this at a state fair, didn't you? No! No, no, absolutely not. It's on sale now. Go pick it up, quick. We'll be right back. So there you have it. Everything you needed to know about the faces for fall. Thanks to the WB and Vincene, I guess we're out of here. I've been. No way. Why not? You're not on this address. Come on, we'll go off. Grab a burrito or something. Move out, I'll drive. <laughs>